listen to me very carefully because if you want this i don't care how long the video ends up being i will do it all right this is my next idea for the you know upcoming worldwide celebration i uploaded a video going over hey what if it's gt related what could we get part one part two easy aids all that good stuff now this right here is actually my dream celebration all right what i actually really 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 want to see and again if you want to see it i will make another video going over make literally creating passives for these characters easy a concepts i will go through every single character make a concept for every single character and go through all the content i want to see all the dragonstone literally missions for this missions for that i'm telling you right now i would go crazy the video might end up being two three hours long because again i'm going through passes i'm making up I'm, I'm going through literally everything but again i don't mind doing it i i feel like it's it's fun to be that creative sometimes and for my favorite celebration here i think this could be really good but this right here isn't that deep this is just going over what i want to see and the important parts of it you could add things and say mr baby wouldn't why didn't you add this character or that character again this is more so of a really quick snapshot of what i want to see for the worldwide celebration this is again i would consider this um my favorite conceptually celebration so this is worldwide part one this is what i would really 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 like to see um typings and stuff don't really matter but for the dokkan fests obviously i want to have a z broly and i want to have a goku um that gut punches z broly you know we don't have that goku in the game yet i think it's criminal it is what it is now some concerns right away another super saiyan goku i know it, it's it it is what it is now the reason why this is green and this is red i mean this could be str broly this could be tech goku typings don't matter i just wanted to give it a color and move on um honestly if you had to ask me i would probably make z bro like an int character um agl no i wouldn't give him physical or str either goku again you can make him age it doesn't matter like you can t if i have if you want it again and i go into super super in depth with this concept and you know create passes and everything then i'll actually think about what typings i want but right now the colors are just there to look a little bit visually appealing i don't care whether they're str whatever the case is okay moving on now the concept for broly here i would love broly to be a character who similar to the physical um i think it was 2020 uh top frieza that you can transform immediately from turn one i would love if z broly had an immediate active skill as base to go into the restricted super saiyan and then an immediate active skill um to go into legendary super saiyan but i want these forms to have different perks or different abilities so you only transform if you want to do this or maybe you can stack in base um there's a reason why you want to stack there's a reason why you want to transform so no matter what enemy you're facing no matter what situation you're in there's an option for you maybe the enemy doesn't really you know do that much damage in turn one so maybe you'll get away with stacking a few times but maybe transforming into the restricted super saiyan gives you you know one turn immunity or or you know one turn of this where you want to really take advantage of that maybe he also stacks not as greatly as base form broly maybe but of course when you go into z broly here he just becomes a demon i really want him to be the tankiest character in the game when he releases then we have super saiyan goku here it could be a goku and z fighters I, I don't really know what it would be most likely just a super saiyan goku there may be a base goku and a super saiyan again i don't know um but the point here is that i want goku to have uh some sort of maybe ko so instead of bird coup, it's him just being absolutely defeated from broly then everyone giving him energy um how cool would it be if like the entire team loses like 50 percent attack but then goku earns like you know 250 whatever the the math would end up being 250 300 attack from everyone else on the team and then performs like this guaranteed crit ultimate damage three like something just a one shot the enemy basically right uh because i think this this attack here defeating a demon like broly i think this should be like the game's first and maybe only guaranteed one shot um ability here but maybe it has to be really hard to pull off. I, I, I don't know how it would work, to be completely honest with you. Um, but that would be really cool. 
now in terms of easy ace i want to see super easy ace for these three right here um i think it would be real i mean it's fitting how could we possibly not see this um and maybe they make these guys extremely cohesive so once they're all on the rotation together or maybe two of them are on the rotation together they end up doing you know more damage they have more stats more damage reduction more support whatever the case ends up being right but i think these guys should definitely get their super easy ace in part one of this celebration being focused of course on uh you know the broly movie and this is of course this is this is i know this broly uh, screenshot is from from um i should have said it before but this broly screenshot is from heroes I, it doesn't really matter the concept i'm trying to come forth here is that this is um the legendary super set this is the first movie because we don't have an lr broly from the first movie every lr broly in the game unfortunately um is from second coming right str broly is from the scene where he emerges from the lava that gohan tried to uh throw him in after taking back shots from broly and then tag broly i mean there is the super saiyan broly that the tech lr tech broly has that form is only present in second coming so every those are the only lrz broly's in the game so we need a you know regular legendary super saiyan lr broly in the game and then for easy ace i want to see an easy a for saiyan day broly if you think it's too early i don't care this is what i want <laughs> then we have a sub easy a for this gohan um really good movie hero support uh and then we have a free to play easy a uh, extreme z area for this str videl um and that is basically what part one would be again there's more content there's more missions there's more this that and the third and i could probably think of more easy a's and more stuff but i think for part one having these three extra, uh, super easy a's and then a Dokkan Fest easy in part one. And then these guys, I think that's just definitely good enough, right? That is what I would want to see basically in a nutshell for part one. And then we have part two, okay? Now part two, maybe you know what I'm going with this. Maybe you don't. My favorite, uh, even though Broly is my favorite character in literally all of Dragon Ball, my favorite movie is Fusion Reborn. And so part two, I want it to be fusion reborn related. And this is what I came up with here. This is what I really want to see. I know this is good. Both, I mean, both of these are going to be carnival characters. Okay. Now the first, uh, the first character is going to be a Goku and PyCon. Now may, that may not be extremely hype up. It just really depends on obviously how, how OP the characters end up being. But I think a Goku and PyCon would be really, really cool. Uh, categories may be a little bit you know the the important thing is that if the character is really good and uh, if they can fit on at least a decent amount of teams or at least be really good on the teams that they have um because i know obviously they're going to have things like other world warriors they're going to have uh joint forces honestly we can uh, movie heroes is the obvious stuff right if they can release an update, you know, that this gives this gives them like pure Saiyans and stuff, that'd be really cool. But yeah, I, I want to Goku and PyCon. May not be the most realistic thing, but I, I think it's it's an we could just get base Gogeta too. I mean, if you want a just base carnival LR Gogeta. Because I was thinking about having these two as just base. Um, but I really wanted to get Goku and PyCon in there. I think they have some really cool animations in Fusion Reborn. Um, that we could really get with a character like this and then i want to stand by where goku and vegeta go off and uh you know try and perform the fusion and janemba is holding sorry uh, pycon is holding janemba off and then after a few a uh, few turns super gogeta comes out and literally destroys the entire game and then on the janemba side of things we have fat janemba uh now i just i actually just realized that i revealed all of this so it is what it is i guess you you know what i'm about to cook up here uh but anyways we have a uh, janemba here now i have this image here of the multiple fat janembas i think it would be really cool if this was like a taunt ability where like you kind of confuse the enemy because there's just so many janembas so what ends up happening is like the boss tries to you know to take down one of the janembas but it doesn't do damage to you right because there's still multiple janembas you haven't really killed the source of janemba right so i i think it'd be really cool if this ended up being some sort of taunt that uh basically worked as like orange piccolo where you can definitely try and take down one of these fat janembas but there's just still so many you're, you're not really doing damage to janemba himself so 
this could be a really cool ability and then boom you go into super janemba super easy a's being the first anniversary characters i think that would be really really cool and very 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 hyped to see specifically super gogeta like if he ends up becoming like one of the demons of the game again at least within the realm of you know these newly released characters that would be very very exciting and very nostalgic for him to be just washing the game right and then for easy ace since you do have one less super easy a i felt comfortable giving at least one more dokkan fest easy a giving easy a's to uh tech janemba and agl pycon two easy a's that i am very excited for because if they just remove these orb restrictions for their support and actually give Janemba some key and just increase his stats a little bit. He will end up being another demon um, because of, again, him already guarding. Pycon could be really good uh, with support and him already being a Ghost Usher gives him value already. So they just increase the stats, give him a few more mechanics, and he's going to be very good as well. And then a new, another Super Strike, uh, not Super Strike, sorry. Um, Extreme Z area stage for this guy to get his easy ace since he doesn't have it just yet. And that is basically part one and part two. Honestly, this right here, like, how can you say that this is not a good worldwide celebration, bro? Come on, man. Come on. Come on. And then part three. Um, I think you already know. Three LRs getting their easy ace. Um, if you can guess, congratulations. And if you can't, then here you go. Whether this is realistic or not, I really don't care. Um, again, we know this guy needs an easy A. And I actually just wanted to give these two guys their easy A's. But then I realized that, like, look, man, I... How can we possibly give this guy an easy A without, you know, not getting him his easy A? He definitely deserves an easy A. I mean, he doesn't really need it as much as Gogeta does, I would argue. Um, but cause I, I think right now Janemba is in a better spot than uh, this Gogeta. So, you know, you give an easy A to this Gogeta and remove the really annoying requirement to get that nullification off. Since I was like what, one of the first nullification characters in the game. And then you give an easy to Janemba. And then you make, finally, you give the GOAT here his freaking easy A, man. Holy. I have been waiting for this for such a long time. You you don't understand how much I'm going to be eating when this guy gets his easy A. And this Z Broly gets his easy A. And then the Z Broly comes. Oh, my God. Uh, the Z Broly team. I'm not going to stop running it. I'm not going to stop running it. I'm not. And on top of that, when you make Janemba the movie bosses... 200 percent oh my god i mean hopefully goku and PyCon don't end up being like <laughs> like <laughs> other world warriors 200 percent right but i mean they could be joined for dude a joined forces 200 percent sounds op i'm i'm just gonna say like a gen a gogeta being a 200 percent to uh join forces that sounds pretty fire man i'm not gonna lie so again Oh, again, but that's just me getting into like the nitty gritty that I will do if you want me to again um, If you don't if people don't really ask for it, I'm not gonna do it um, But if you genuinely want to see that and if you're willing to sit through a, like a two three hour long video of me Just going through like I'm, I'll, I'll make it passive for this guy. Sorry for this guy for I'll literally make a passive for all of these characters here Don't don't play with me man. If, if it regards Z Broly and uh, if, it, if it regards my favorite, uh, you know fusion reborn uh, Dragon Ball movie and then both being in the same rotate, uh, not same rotation, what the heck, same uh, celebration, I will definitely 100% do that. So let me know what you think. Um, this, I think, would be really incredible. Of course, they may have another easy A in part three and some other content, whatever the case is, but this is, as a skeleton, this is basically what I want. And I don't think there's a single, like, you may not be a fan of Fusion Reborn. You may not be a fan of Z Broly, but I think you we can all say that this is a W celebration. Movie bosses um, getting a lot of buffs in here. Movie heroes continuously getting a lot of buffs this year. Um, or a lot of buffs with this celebration specifically. Um, and then finally some easy A's and some super easy A's that we have been waiting for for a very, very, very long time. So let me know what you think. Be honest. I would really appreciate it. And uh, if you want to see a super long video about that, again, let me know. It's crazy because this video is, is almost 15 minutes and um, I didn't go over it. I would literally still be going over the kit for these characters <laughs> at the 15 minute mark here, man. So again, that'll be a long video. But again, I'll do it if you want. Hopefully you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. 
Uh, this is pers if, if you're going to ask me what do I want to see worldwide, I'm going to bring you to this video or the other video that I do about this um, to give you exactly what I want for what. Because this is my this is literally my dream celebration. And if I were to do the long video, I might change up a few things like where certain EZAs are placed because then I'll be real like really going into it and, and and thinking about it with a different like you know trying to go into the nitty-gritty of everything like I may end up changing you know what this could be uh, a Goku and Vegeta a Goku and Vegeta unit instead right which I also didn't want to do because the tech character here does exist um, but if this ends up being look this could, it could literally be what if it was a Goku and Vegeta who turn one was already in standby mode. That'd actually be pretty fire now that I think about it. So what if what if we just deleted this, right? It was literally it was lit let, let's say it's oh, 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 I, I can't even speak because I'm so excited. Imagine it's Angel, Super Saiyan, Vegeta, right? And Goku. That is a newly named character that can link with every other Goku and Vegeta in the game, which is perfect, right? Then we also have a lot of categories there. You got join forces. Um, I, I I don't know. I mean, I would assume you. I guess you don't get super saiyans, right? You should, but I don't. I don't. I really don't know. But yeah, pure saiyan. You get all the. You get all those categories, okay? But turn one, you get that standby. Or maybe you can't attack turn one. Maybe you're supporting. Uh, maybe you have extremely high OP defenses. Um, and you need to take a certain amount of damage or whatever the case is until it's super goji so you basically like turn one you are trying to get kojita out right um which is which i think could be really really cool and could also serve a lot like i think this could be really cool actually because now that i think about it a lot of content nowadays re they really 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 need you to be good in turn one slot one turn one and so a a character being in standby from the get-go and being already like very very strong defensively could be really actually i kind of i kind of like that a little bit now that i think about it right which i think it'd just be more beneficial for both teams anyways but yeah that could be really cool you can link up this character um of course with this guy with any other gojita in the game and now we're cooking so let me know what you think again hopefully you enjoyed i'll see you in the next one merry christmas and good night